So uh, top of the news today, uh, always interesting stuff. I think one of the funnier things I read about is a uh, scanner that you can purchase for home use for $1,400 that will um, basically do a scan of your body uh, and measure body fat and density and all kinds of goodness like that. You know, you stand in front of a mirror and there's a little platform you turn around on and um, it'll help uh, gauge and compare uh, your uh, results if you're trying to lose weight, gain weight, whatever you're trying to do. Uh, kind of interesting, I think. Um, and then let's see what else. Uh, worker satisfaction is at an 18 year high right now. 51% uh, of workers are um, reporting greater job satisfaction and I'd say that's good news. Um, also, a very interesting article uh, called The Latino Factor, uh, which was in the Wall Street Journal, and uh, it reinforces uh, what I recently read in the book The Next Hundred Years by George Friedman, essentially saying that, you know, we are running out of workers and the most likely uh, uh, source for us for future uh, workforce is uh, the uh, the Latino worker, uh, you know, not just blue collar stuff, but also educated and helping fill in the blanks. So, as you are out there going build a wall, I would remind you those same people you're trying to keep out are the ones that our economy needs. And if you'll notice and re remember, only a few days ago, I was talking about uh, certain professions. Uh, nationally, landscape people in particular, uh, anybody, anybody that uses seasonal workers, agriculture, are losing money because they don't have enough workers because they can't get enough of the H-2B visas. So, um, you know, it's just time to recognize, uh, you know, we need more people. And then uh, last but not least, um, really unfortunate today, not surprising, but incredibly disappointing, the Secretary of State in the state of New Mexico, Maggie Toulouse Oliver, um, has acted in an incredibly partisan way, um, contrary to what the voters of the state of New Mexico um, have already voted for, and she has decided to uh, execute straight party ticket balloting this coming general election, which means a voter can walk in and just check off Republican, all Republican candidates, all Democratic candidates, or all Libertarian candidates. But spoiler alert, who do you think is going to really benefit the most? The Democrats, because that's what she is. And she herself is rerunning uh, for a re-up for re-election. And, um, you know, it's pathetic. She's pathetic. It's so disappointing, and this is exactly what voters, if voters want the same thing, if the Democrats want to just check one box and get in two or four more years of the same uh, things in New Mexico, or in this case, two years or six years, um, go for it. Check that box, and you know we can continue to wallow last or second from last um, compared to all the other states. It's going to be the status quo, and the, what Maggie has done is just, it's horrible. So anyway, you have a choice and it may take you an extra few minutes to go candidate by candidate because there are good people in each of the parties that uh, warrant your attention and warrant your vote. So thanks.